Thank you, Fran. Now, if you open any motorcycle riding manual, you'll see something written called the limit point. It talks about the limit point. Some people call it the vanishing point. So what is the limit point? Where is it? And what does it mean? Well, it's the limit of our vision. It's as far as we can see down a road. Now, if you look down here, we've got a left-hand bend coming up. We can see that. It's pretty obvious. The limit point is the furthest point we can see, and it's where the two verges meet. The tarmac actually appears to come to a point. So that is the limit of our vision. Now, the limit point is moving all the time as we're getting into the bend as we're going further down the road the limit point was further away now we can actually make it appear further away by approaching the bend at different parts of the road and we've spoken in the past about if we approach a left hand bend on the left hand side of the road near the verge near the pavement if you like our vision around the bend is limited so if we were to approach this bend on the right of our lane towards the crown of the road the limit point would be further away now as we get into the bend that limit point is moving if it gets further away all the time as we're approaching it, it means the road is opening up. Obviously, it's opening up, so the limit point's getting further away. So generally, we can accelerate. If it appears to be coming closer, and coming closer at a fair old rate, then the road is tightening. That bend is actually tightening. That's telling us we're probably going too fast. We need to slow down. The ideal scenario is that the limit point stays at the same distance away from your bike. So if you're going around and you're looking at where the two verges meet that's your point if it stays constant generally speaking you're going at the right speed for that bend